holistic margin management is a across the company discipline. We look for waste uh, in all of our, uh, our products and, and processes and find that waste and, and eliminate it. And there are countless examples of, uh, of how we do that from uh, maybe making our yogurt packages uh, thinner walls, less material, to uh, finding better ways to ship our products to our customers, more efficient ways. So we're getting more products uh, on, a, on a truck or we're getting more cases on a pallet. So it can be some things that are mundane to saving materials to better processes, but it all has added up to uh, a lot of money uh, over time. We committed three years ago that we would uh, generate a billion dollars uh, in uh, uh, HMM by the end of uh, fiscal year 12, which we're just entering, and we are very confident uh, that we are going to find those, uh, uh, find those savings. So innovation is, is, is a core uh, strategy and a core value uh, for General Mills and it will be a key part of and a key growth driver uh, for us as we go into this new fiscal year. Uh, we announced uh, a number of new products as part of our uh, uh, release today. We've got uh, very good new cereals, a product called Fiber One, uh, 80 calories. So this is a great tasting product, very low in calories, a good source of fiber. We think consumers are going to like that. Uh, we're launching Fiber One 90 calorie brownies. Uh, and uh, that, we think, is going to appeal to consumers. Great tasting, it's chocolate, uh, but very low in calories, a good source of fiber, and you know, a great combination of benefits for, uh, for consumers. We're launching, uh, we're entering the, the breakfast, uh, hot breakfast category with a couple of products under the Pillsbury brand name, Pillsbury, uh, Pillsbury Scrambles. We've had a very successful uh, uh, product in Canada for the last few years uh, that we're going to bring into the U.S. And this is a product called Totino's Pizza Stuffers. And it moves that Totino's brand into a little bit more of the light meal occasion. And this is a very fast growing part of the grocery store. So we've got very good new products, not only in the US, but around the world. We're launching uh, Haagen-Dazs uh, Sweet Sensations, uh, which is a mixture of ice cream and sauce. Uh, and we're launching those products in, uh, in Western Europe, uh, off to a very good start. So great uh, product innovation around the world, more than to come. Uh, in the second half of the year as well, so nice balance uh, across the year. So international continues to be uh, a key part of the growth story uh, for General Mills. We had a particularly good year uh, this year in, uh, in Europe uh, and in Asia. I mean, we grew everywhere, but very strong in Europe, uh, led by the growth of the haagen business uh, in Western, uh, Western Europe, uh, Old El Paso, uh, Mexican foods did work very well in Europe. Uh, our Nature Valley uh, products, our healthy snacking bars, are doing well uh, not only in Europe and, uh, but around the world. And China had a terrific year, uh, another terrific year. Our, uh, our haagen restaurants uh, are doing very, very well in China. We're expanding the number of cities uh, where you can find a uh, haagen cafe uh, or restaurant. And our frozen food business, uh, Wan Chai Ferry products, continue to do very, very well. We are expanding that line. Uh, we're expanding the number of cities uh, where those products are available. And uh, you know, together, those combine to create a, a wonderful growth story, again, for General Mills China.